On Sky Sports tomorrow, don't miss Manchester United against Millwall in the FA Cup final. And in the Scottish Cup final, Celtic take on Don Firmlin. This is Sky Sports. Tell me more about the air conditioning, Rodney. I'm fascinated. Air conditioning? You told me you run an air conditioning firm? Well, we have a few vans out on jobs at once most of the time. You know, it's always busier in the summer, of course. Nothing like a soaring temperature to help the work, you know what I mean? Anyway, most of the time I just sit around the office waiting for the weekend. Don't get me wrong, I love the money the job pays. But my real passion lies in kicking people's fucking heads in at football. You see, I've got to channel it somewhere. As you can probably tell by my bulging stomach, I don't participate in too many sporting activities. And I don't do drugs. Well, it's not entirely true, but not a lot. So I've got to have my release in saying a good fucking fight seems like the best way, wouldn't you agree? Maybe not. At least I wouldn't be walking around like you lot. Fucking horrible cunts with sticks shoved up your asses trying to pretend your little suburban nightmare's all right. Then again, I suppose it just depends which way you look at it. Mate, can we have to...? No. Everybody and welcome back to Bramall Lane for an exciting Worthington Cup fixture. There will be a capacity crowd here tonight of about 26,500 people. From us, that group will be hooligans. You know Stanley? Whose sole intent tonight will be to cause trouble, fight with Sheffield United supporters if they can, and fight with the police if they can. But you've definitely got some of our top boys in here. Where now? See you, you cunt. I'll cut you first. There's nothing different about me. I'm just another bored male approaching 30 in a dead-end job who lives for the weekend. Casual sex, walk with Dan Lager, heavily cut drugs, and occasionally kicking fuck out of someone. See you, you cunt. You know Stanley? I'll cut you first. What else are you going to do on a Saturday? Sit in your fucking armchair wanking off to pop idols, then try and avoid your wife's gaze as you struggle to come to terms with your sexless marriage, then go and spunk your wages on kebabs, fruit machines and brasses. Fuck that for a laugh. I know what I'd rather do. Love it. We're an island race. It's what we do best. It's not about colour or race, it's just the buzz of being in the front line. The truth is, I just love to fight. There's nothing wrong with me. See you, you cunt. You know Stanley? I'll cut you first. Out. Football violence is, is back on the agenda. The Home Office has published a league table of hooligans. This has had a major effect on Sheffield United thugs, who are eighth from the bottom. They've been bent on violence ever since in an attempt to get to the top of the hooligans table. Listen, this is a fact, right? Past two seasons, right? We have rumbled everyone in here. We come in peace. We leave you in peace. Oh, look, Fisher! Yeah! All officers, stand fast. This every... All officers, policy for pitch invasion is arrest. They want to contain it first and support the stewards. See you, you cunt. Do you know Stanley? I'll catch you first. Horses onto the pitch. Horses onto the pitch. They need to go into the stand. I think there's officers in trouble inside the stand. Do you know what sociology is? Yeah, I do. I've got an A-level in it. Clever, get an I. Get it! Sociology 
It's the study of social problems now, you. You got a big social problem, boss. Get it! This is your winner. You've got to walk up and down the street every fucking night. And you're going to see me everywhere. And I don't like seeing people who let me down because it gets me mad! Yeti! So you'll win. Both of you! Yeti! That's a bit of good pressure, that is. <laughs> it's a real battle stuff. Over! I'll tell you something. If they stop their football, right, stop their rucks at football, we go boxing, we go snooker, yeah. we go dance. 200 officers have been involved in policing this match tonight. It's cost around £45,000. Just go away. We don't need people like you around. Get them shifted. Oh, off the road. Off the road. You don't have to push people, do you? Only people like you, Sonny. Policing football matches like this means that there will be less officers on the streets all year round. The majority of the public who have no interest in football are paying the price. See you, you cunt. You know, Stanley? I'll catch you first. When I have fucking kids, I'll teach them to fucking hate you!